making his way to the ring, Kofi Sato! All right, y'all, everybody out there watching this broadcast, this is Bad Ronan, Michael Gomez. We are in the house. We're live here at the Henry Clay Event Center, Louisville, Kentucky. We're here for some live pro boxing action tonight. We got a packed house. Everybody's in. We got our first fighters in the ring. You have a bout sheet. Okay. Give me a minute for the announcement here for the fighters for the first fight. Okay, we got our first two fighters in the ring. Referee given last instructions. We got Ryan Venerable fighting out of Roanoke. And we have his opponent, Kofi Smith, fighting out of Champaign, Illinois. Kofi in the blue corner. Venable in the red. We get ready for the opening bell. And there it is. We're live. Both fighters step into the center of the ring, exchange a few blows. Venable pushes back on Smith. Kofi throws a nice one-two. Nice left hook. Venable, a little tentative. Moving forward, both fighters in the center of the ring. Both fighters nice and calm here. One of the fighters lost his mouthpiece. Referee quick to get that. Get these right guys right back to the action. Corner calling for a one-two. Gets a one-two. Kofi pushing forward. Nice lead left hook by Venable. Kofi comes back with a one-two of his own. A little slip push. Venable reaches for an uppercut and misses. Nice strong left hand by Venable. Kofi returns fire, moves forward. Let's go, 
Ooh, nice left hand by Venable. Scores. Coach tells Coffey, shoot a jab. Shoot that jab. Nice, another left hook there. This fighter's right over me here in the corner. Coffee scores a nice few quick hands on a combination there. Wind it down, end of the first round. Nice little short uppercut there at the end. Both fighters look composed, move back to the corners. I want to take a second to welcome you guys all again. We're, we're here live at the uh, Henry Clay Event Center, downtown Louisville, Kentucky. Live pro boxing action. You know, 2020 was a long year. Most of us didn't get a chance to come out and do anything like this, so getting a chance to be back out here in 2021, it feels great. I'm sure all these people sitting here are appreciating this fights tonight. We've got, a, we've got an amazing card tonight. Got a lot of people coming up to fight tonight. We got heavyweights, we got middleweights, and we got lightweights. We've even got welterweights. I'm telling you guys, we got Ubaldo Lara, El Capitan. We got Ibaldo Lara from Indianapolis fighting on the card tonight. We sure do. We got Timothy Mayhem Moten, heavyweight prospect, fighting on this card tonight. And we're back, second round. Pick up right here where we left off. Both fighters eager to get in the center. Exchange a few blows. Kofi takes a nice stance, moves forward, fires a few shots. Continues to move forward. Venable takes a left hand and a right hand to the stomach. Nice short left jab there. Venable. Followed by another one. It's not quite meeting, the, meeting his spot, but he's still getting those punches in there. Moving, he's working. Kofi catches him with a nice little left check hook. Nice uppercut there by Kofi. Nice uppercut to the body. Nice thunderous sound. Another one there. Not as hard. No right hand, straight right hand. Another body shot. Let other side body shot, left hand. I think I think Coffee's starting to find where he needs to be, and that's on the inside and the outside of that body. He's got that nice reach. He looks like he's well conditioned. He's just got him again. Right hand to the gut. Now he starts putting that left hand on the body, and we might see Venable go down. These fighters are both still standing toe to toe. Venable says he caught one in the in the cup. Ref didn't give it too much attention. Another left hand, the body there. So that right hand's not as bad, but that left hand of the body is terrible. <laughs> it really is. A little push there of Venable. The ref's gonna warn him for that. He's gonna tell him we don't do that here. Please, let's not do that. They right back, they resume action. Venable scores a left hand. Venable's uh, trying to close the distance, but he's ducking his head. And he's gonna, he's gonna keep catching those uppercuts because that's what happens when you duck your head and you drop your eyes. You're gonna catch uppercuts and short hooks as well, but 
Either way, it's not good. <laughs> Kofi, Kofi continues this attack with the body. Referee is going to... He's calling a foul. One, one point. Is that a warning or a point? I believe that was... That's the end of the second round. Pretty thunderous. Yeah, we're over here discussing some of those body shots in that last round. Uh, for you at home, I'm sure you heard it as well. Okay, we back third round. These fighters came out aggressive here. They, they're exchanging blow for blow right now in the center of the ring. Venom came out this third round. His corner must have really told him something. So you're going to keep eating them body shots if you don't get your head up and get your eyes up. Now we're, we're looking at a second point for low blows here. Was that first one a warning? Is the first one a warning or a point? Okay, so I, I'm thinking that that's two points against Coffee for low blows. Well, one more point for that could cause him a disqualification. So we don't, well, we don't really want to go there. He needs to get those punches up. That was a nice attempt there for an uppercut. Just missed it. Ven Venable keeps ducking his head. And I'm gonna I'm gonna say if, if I was to tell his, him or to talk to him, I say you gotta keep your head up. You cannot step forward and drop your eyes. You will get hit every time. He th Venable just threw a nice left cross. Kofi moving forward, missed the overhand right, stepping forward, pawn pawn that. That left hand out there a little bit, looking for nice placement for that right hand. But I believe he's going to go back to the body. I'm, I'm anticipating him stepping in, move, moving inside there and getting to his body. And every time I see him drop his head and I see his eyes down, I'm going to catch him with a short hook. I'm going to catch him with the uppercut. Kofi moves forward, throws the right hand, catches the left hand by Venable. Nice straight right hand by Kofi. Venable, oh, Venable's, Venable scores the left hand and sets Kofi down. That was nice. That was right on the money, right in the mush, set him down. That was, that was nice. Venable moves to the left, hits him with a left hand, right hand combination. Left hook, he's moving. Venable should press forward right now. Oh, this is a beautiful momentum shift in this fight. He's already got a two point advantage because there's two points for low blows against Coffey. So right now he's, he's winning this fight right now. He needs to move, he needs to stick and move. Stay out of that corner, turn out of that corner. Nice right hand, turn, move, get out of that corner. There you go, get your hands up. Okay. Moving around a little bit. I would press the fight forward. I do not move backwards. 
He was evading until the end of the round. We get through that third round, and that was a good one. That was a that was a 10-8 round with that knockdown. He changed the mic. Momentum shift. Be beautiful momentum shift right there. What do y'all think about that knockdown? Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Bap. Okay, guys, we're getting ready to start the fourth round. That was exciting. That round was good. I like that. There's the bell. Both these fighters are at it. Here we go. <laughs> Kofi knew he had to come out and get aggressive. He scores a left hook there. The, these fans are, are stirring right now because they know we got us a fight here. It, it got urgent for Kofi now because he's going to lose this fight if he doesn't turn this around. His corner, I'm sure, told him go out there and press this fight. Okay, Kofi, back at Grin, aggressive here, press, pressing forward, nice right hand to the body. Like I said, this fight has changed. The urgency in this fight has changed. Braun. Brown. Brown. All right, guys. Uh, tonight I got Fred Brown sitting in here with me. He's going he's gonna to be here with me. We're going to call some of this action for you. Uh, we're right here in the middle of this fight. Uh, Fred, what uh, did you just get here? Or are yeah, you? I just, I just got here. Okay, we're Whatever. in the fourth round. Yeah. We had two points for low blow from Kofi to Venable. Yeah. And then we had a flash knockdown, straight left hand from Venable to Coffee in the third round. Okay, good it uppercut. was sweet. Good so uppercut. here we are right oh, nice now. Uppercut. Yeah, okay. so that so they're mad now. <laughs> All right, yeah. Yeah, they're ready to fight. Uh, and the momentum shift a couple times, but he was already going to win the if it went to decision because he had oh, the really? two points from, mm. uh, for the low blow. Okay. So and then this, the knockdown was really a game changer. So Coffee's got pressure on him right now. Uh-huh. He's got to be he's got to be that guy. He's got to change the fight. He's got to put him down probably. Uh, four rounds. Uh, four okay. rounds. Oh, excuse it's me. It's over. Yeah, see? Yeah, I'm sorry. I got uh, a little distracted there. It's all right. But, so, okay, so now we're at the end of this contest, and I'm going to say, I'm going to say based on what I've seen, what I just shared with mm -hmm. you, Fred, yeah. I say that uh, it's going to absolutely be a decision to Venable. Ven Venable. And I wish you would have seen the knockdown. Do oh, we have man. a replay on the knockdown? Man, it is sold out there. Yeah, well, Fred, I want to welcome you. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me a little something? Tell me where you're from. Um, I'm from right here in Louisville, Kentucky. Okay. And, and you are a boxer. Yeah, yeah, I'm a pro boxer, yeah. You're a pro boxer. Yeah. Who do you fight with? I've only had um, with TKO, Top Notch. Oh. Yeah. James Dixon. Yeah. You know. I was with I, uh, I was with Timothy Moulton for a while. I mean, we still nice. train on the side. And all nice. That. That's yeah, perfect. That's I'm, I'm right glad there. to hear yeah, that. Okay, so – so, uh, just a little bit of background here. I'm from Indianapolis. I'm Michael Gomez, aka Bad Ronan. Okay. Uh, I'm that guy. I, I'm a I'm a amateur boxing coach over in Indianapolis. Mm -hmm. um, I I help coach train uh, amateur boxers for USA Boxing with yeah. uh, Sugar Ray Seals, 1972 Olympic gold medalist Ray Seals, oh, with Team IBG in Indianapolis.